Hi cuties, Winnie here. Today we're going to draw my Draw So Cute logo. So let's get started. Before I begin, I wanted to thank you cuties for all the requests to draw my Draw So Cute logo. I'm just so grateful you guys even want to draw this. So if you haven't already subscribed, please do and become a cutie. So to draw this cartoon version of myself, let's first start by drawing the face. So I'm going to come right here and draw a very wide bottom of a U. So it's very wide and flat. So I'm going to say about right here. And I'm just going to go ahead and connect it. So the bottom is pretty flat. And connect. So something like that, nice and wide. And then from there, I'm going to come back to where I started. And on the edge, I'm going to draw a circle. And same thing on the other side. So let's have it right here. Once again, towards the edge. Okay, so we have the two circles in. Now let's go in there and make them draw so cute eyes. So I'm going to put two smaller circles inside for highlights. Kind of at an angle and a curve line at the bottom and shade in the top. And the lines at the bottom. And same thing over here. So I created this logo years ago when I first started my channel. And it was supposed to be kind of like a very simplified cartoon version of me. <laughs> that was the goal originally. Um, so I used to draw faces like this all the time very wide faces because I always feel like I have a very wide face <laughs> and so um, that was always kind of like my caricature of myself and then lines at the bottom okay so then from there I'm going to come to the side right here I'm just going to give two very simple little lashes so two little curves and then right here in the center but right here I'm just going to give a little smirk smile so about right here. Very cute, simple little smile. From there, let's come up and we're going to start to draw her hair. So I'm going to say about right here is nice and flat. So I'm just going to come to the side right here, about right in this area. And I'm just going to draw one strand of hair. And then from there, I'm going to bring in a curve and come right under. I mean, come right back to where we started with her face. So then on this side, it's going to curve right back down to this side. So it's just a curve. And then it's going to come right there. And out. So and then let's finish her hair. So her hair kind of parts on this side, on the side right here. So imagine coming about right here. I'm just going to give myself a point. And from here, I'm just going to go up with a curve, come down. And then this side's going to go up. So let's work on this side first. I'm just going to bring this down. And on this side, it's just going to curve in and out. So it's a little bit more tapered on this side. And then let's go up on this side, a bit higher. And as we come down to this side, we're going to slope down. And about right here, I'm just going to bring out a strand of hair and go back in come out and around. Okay, so then from there, um, my original drawing doesn't have eyebrows. I don't know why. <laughs> so I'll just leave it as is with no eyebrows. And then let's come and draw the body first before I finish the hair. Um, so right in the center, uh, let's come about right here. I'm just going to draw a curve and then very simply come about right here and I'm just going to draw two curves that come down for her body 
and then come out with a curve right here for her shoulders on both sides. So I'm going to bring this down a tiny bit more. So say about right here and I'm going to end it at the same level because I know I'm going to be drawing this in a kind of like a box. So let's bring this down. I'm going to stop right there. Bring this sleeve down. Bring it in. Give it a little stripe. And same thing over here. Let's drag a point across. A little stripe. And then just finish it off at the same level as the shirt there. And then I'm just going to finish off the hair. So just bring in some strands, zigzags. And just end everything at the same level. And I'm just going to bring this in. So then from there, that is pretty much it, except I'm going to add a heart right here since I didn't do that before. <laughs> it's just something I kind of developed as I started drawing to add a heart to almost all of my draw circuit drawings. And that is pretty much it for the drawing. So I'm going to put it into a, um, a square now or a rectangle. See what, what shape I get. I'm just going to use my popsicle stick to make my straight lines so I don't mess it up too much because it is pretty big. So I'm going to go around it. See about right there. And then I'm going to just create eight. A box around it. I'm just looking at my camera now to make sure my lines are, are as straight as possible. I might be off, <laughs> but I'm trying my best here. So about right, let's say right here. Okay, kind of, and then at the top. There. That is pretty much it for my Dross It Cute logo. Um, but if you want to leave it as uh, like this, then just go ahead and finish coloring it. But if you want to, I thought it'd be pretty cute to make it like a little Polaroid. So I'm just going to go around it and make it a Polaroid. So I'm just going to go around and give it an edge. So this part's a little bit easier because I have a guide now. So I'm going to come all the way down. about right there. I'll go this way. And about right there on the other side. It's so hard when I can't put my head over the drawing. <laughs> I can't see. Okay, and then one more line right at the bottom. There. And ta-da! I've created a Polaroid, right? So now that I've created this Polaroid, I'm going to write something here just for fun to finish it off. So let's see here. Um, what should I write? I love you cuties, of course, right? <laughs> and then I'll just sign it. I need to work on my signature there. And then a little heart. So there, I hope I helped you draw my Draw So Cute logo and this inspires you to give it a try as well. Thanks so much for watching and if you loved it, please make sure to subscribe and turn on your notification bell so you won't miss any new Draw So Cute videos. See you later.